Hello everybody, welcome to Roblox Squeeze. It's better to give than to receive, as they say. And what better thing to give your Roblox friends than Robux? But before we begin, make sure to subscribe to the channel because it only takes two seconds to do so and all the cool kids are doing it. Okay, enough is enough. Let's give you all what you clicked on. Starting off with the first way you can give Robux to your friends in Roblox is to make a group. Making a group in Roblox allows you to utilize the group funds feature which will let you give Robux to your friends. This is the most effective method to give Robux to your friends but it takes a lot of time and money to set up. In order for you to create a group in Roblox you have to spend at least 100 Robux but the good thing is that you'll have the group forever and you won't have to pay annually or monthly. Once you have created your own Roblox group, you can create a Game Pass for it, and you can purchase that Game Pass yourself or ask other people to. Then, the profit you make from the Game Pass will go into your group funds, and you can use the funds to give Robux to members of your group, such as your friend. Speaking about Game Passes, they are the second method that you can try to give Robux to your friends. In Roblox, make sure that your friend has their own Roblox game, and tell them to make a Game Pass for it. Then, tell them to set up a price for that Game Pass and make it the price of the amount of Robux that you want to give them. After that, they can publish the Game Pass and you can purchase it from your friend. Once you purchase the Game Pass from your friend, they'll be able to get the Robux into their account. The only downside of this method is that Roblox will take 30% of the transaction, so if you purchase a Game Pass that costs 1000 Robux, your friend will only receive 700. Now, in a different situation where your friend wants to send Robux to you, just repeat the same method, but you should make the Game Pass instead of your friend. Once you publish the Game Pass for one of your games, and once your friend purchases it, you will be able to see the Robux in your Roblox account within 3 days. The reason why you have to wait for 3 days is because Roblox has to confirm the transaction and it takes some time. The next method is via trading. Trading is one of the most effective methods to give Robux to your friends because Roblox does not take a 30% cut, and the transactions will not have to wait for 3 days. So how this works is that you'll want to make a trade offer to your friend where you offer them Robux in exchange for one of their items. It doesn't have to be a valuable item, it can be the most worthless item that they own, or you can just give them Robux with nothing in return. Once you make the trade offer, make sure that your friend accepts it. The only downside of this method is that you and your friend will both need a Roblox premium subscription, but it isn't much of an obstacle because the subscription costs as little as $5. And finally, the last method you can try is to purchase Robux gift cards. Robux gift cards are an alternative method that you can use to give Robux to your friends if you don't have any Robux in your account, or if you are not allowed to make purchases online. You can find Robux gift cards in your nearest retail store, and once you get one, all you need to do is send the gift card code to your friend. Then, they'll be able to redeem the code in exchange it for Robux that you purchased for them. As a bonus method, you can tell your friend to make their own Roblox game and create microtransactions for it. Then, you can head into the game and purchase in-game items. This method isn't the most effective, but it's pretty beneficial if your friend knows how to code in Roblox. Alright guys, so unfortunately this video has come to an end, that is it on how to give Robux to friends on Roblox. Since you guys have reached here, I just want to remind you to subscribe so you will not miss any of our upcoming Roblox videos. Also, like the video as it helps us beat the YouTube algorithm and lets this topic be delivered to more people. And lastly, share this video so we can inform others. With that, thank you so much for watching, goodbye, and I'll see you in the next video.